Hello there, it's the Easy Engineering once again. For today's topic, we're going to talk about proportion. What is proportion? Proportion is simply a statement that two ratios are equal, where ratio means how many times one number contains another. So let's say you have 1 is to 3 is equal to 2 is to 6. The ratio is equal, therefore 1, 3, 2, and 6 are proportion. Also, 1 and 6 terms are called the extremes and 3 and 2 are the means. The product of the extremes is equal to the product of the means. Therefore, if we multiply 1, 2, 6, the answer will be 6. And if we multiply 3 to 2, the answer is also 6. Therefore, the terms are proportion. Let's have another example. Suppose you have two ropes. First rope has a length of 20 meters and a weight of 1 kilogram while the second rope has, has a length of 40 meters and a weight of 2 kilograms. Are the two ropes proportion? The ratio of rope 1 is 20 is to 1, while the rope 2 is 40 is to 2. So we can write it like this. To know if the two ratios are equal, let's locate first the extremes and means. So 20 and 2 are the extremes and 40 and 1 are the means. Product of extremes is always equal to the product of means. Therefore, the extremes 20 times 2 is equal to 40 and the, the means 40 times 1 is equal to 40. Therefore, the two ratios are equal and the terms are proportion. Now for another example. Suppose these two glasses are proportion. Find the width of the glass. So let's combine first the length of the glasses in the right side and the width of the glasses on the left side. The equation will look like this. Let's apply the proportionality rule which is the product of the extremes is equal to the product of the means. The extremes in the problem are 4 and the variable x and the means are 2.5 and 4.8. Let's multiply the extremes first. 4 times variable x is equal to 4x and 2.5 times 4.8 is equal to 12. The equation will become 4x equal to 12. So to find the value of x, let's divide both sides by 4, and the value of x is 3. Therefore, the width of the second glass is 3 inches. So that's the concept of proportion. It is easy, right? Before we end this video, I will flash first a problem and try to answer it. These two triangles are similar triangle, therefore they are in proportion. Now what is the value of B? Are you then answering? Now let's try to solve it together and find out if we have the same answer. The basis of the two triangles are 5 and 4 and the other leg of the triangle is 6 and a variable B. So let's form now the equation. The equation will look like this. So we already know how to locate the extremes and means. Therefore, the extremes in this equation are 5 and variable b, and the means are 4 and 6. So using again the proportionality rule, which is product of the extremes is equal to the product of the means, 5 multiplied by variable b is equal to 5b, and 4 multiplied to 6 is equal to 24. To find the value of the variable b, we need to divide both sides by 5. Therefore, the value of variable b is... 4.8. That's it guys. I hope you learned a lot about proportion. You can also watch other video tutorials here in our channel. Once again, this is Easy Engineering. We make engineering topics easy and fun for you.